Zelina vs face swag in a 1v1 they decided to do this and the loser had to do 50 push-ups on stream and we all know with Zelina being a little bit of a fatty you know a little bit of a hermit he didn't want to do these 50 push-ups so you best believe this guy turned on the cheats against face swag and we're going to show you a couple of examples in fact more than a couple of examples of zelena doing just that and toggling aim bot on throughout in the first clip we're about to show you now you will clearly see his aim snap onto the enemy who starts shooting at him first take a look So it is painfully obvious how his aim was toggled on in that moment. That guy started shooting at him first, he had the high ground, he had the upper hand in every situation, in any way you can think of. That guy should have beat Zelena in the gunfight, but Zelena's aim just snaps onto him perfectly in that moment. The next clip we're going to go into now is actually the one we used for the hook of this video. He goes out, turns left to the door, starts shooting, obviously toggles his aim bot on in that moment, hoping that the guy was to his left. But what it does, it snaps his aim to the right to the point where his aim's actually locked onto and snapped onto that perfect position of the enemy before his gun and everything else is even adjusted. Take a look. Z. Z. That one, probably one of the most damning clips throughout the whole video. You can clearly see how the aim differs from what aim assist is meant to do in the game, which means the Z lane that is using something else other than built in aim assist, right? Let me know your thoughts on that in the comments below so far. The next clip we've got right now is another situation where Z lane's aim is just pinpoint accurate. There's absolutely no movement in his gun whatsoever, and he seems to know how to lock onto these enemies perfectly. We are concentrating on the second enemy in this clip. The first guy, you can see natural movement in his aim, which is what's leading me to believe the Z lane is not using in-game aim assist when he's having these snaps and locks. He's picking and choosing when he presses his foot on his foot pedal to activate his Zane bot. So I believe that clip was extremely damning and obviously we know at this point that Zelena is cheating because he can't perform this way when he's on LAN events and there are definitely malfunctions happening with his aim. Either that or he's turned them up a little bit because he wasn't getting as many kills as he used to early in Verdansk. Now in the next clip that we've got, it isn't as blatant as the ones we've just seen. He has a UAV active so he knows the general location of the enemy. However, we have zoomed in and slowed it down so you can see the adjustments his aim makes once he ADSs towards the location. You can see that the aim snaps up to the enemy's head before the enemy comes around the corner from the wall. Take a look. I fucking... Now that right there looks to me like an aimbot snap. It looks like he didn't have his crosshair in the position where his aim is actually set to. It looks like he toggled aimbot on and we could visually see the snap of his aim snapping up to the enemy's head. Let me know your thoughts on that one as well, guys. There is another clip now that I'm going to show you where there are two instances of his aim snapping up onto the enemy, perfectly positioned around the neck area. This right here shows that he is toggling aimbot on. I believe that this is a very blatant moment and it's on the same enemy, but two times we see his aim behave the same way. Yes. 
So I think it's safe to say when it comes to these guys playing against each other, they don't care if they're using cheats. If you actually go and compare the aim behavior of Z-Laner throughout that game to FaZe Swag's aim behavior, it's like night and day, honestly. And I've seen FaZe Swag have an aimbot snaps in the past, but in that gameplay, there was nothing that indicated to me that FaZe Swag had anything other than built-in aim assist. He was missing bullets all the way through. And guess what? After Z-Laner having all them aimbot snaps throughout the gameplay, he still lost to FaZe Swag and ended up having to do the 50 push-ups at the end. I wonder how that went. Z-Laner lost and he couldn't even do the 50 push-ups in one straight row. Definitely an absolute clown and a hermit who just sits behind the desk day in day out with zero exercise by the looks of it. And even with aimbot, he couldn't beat FaZe Swag. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below guys. In my opinion, I believe that Z-Laner is one of the most suspicious gamers in the Call of Duty Warzone space who has managed to bypass it and get away with it for this long let me know your thoughts in the comments below i am definitely going to be reading through them and if you did enjoy today's video guys smash that thumbs up and give the video a share let's show people just how shady z laner actually is and if you are new to the channel subscribe and turn on notifications because we're on our way to a million subscribers and also you don't want to miss our future uploads if you want to contact me about a streamer who you believe is cheating you can hit me up on twitter at badboybeeman1 and one last thing before we go. If you're anything like me and you're dealing with daily stress and a lot of anxiety, believe me when I say this, Supreme CBD products are unreal. These gummies have helped me massively with the anxiety and stress of my everyday workload and they could probably help you too if you're dealing with those things. I've got other products here as well including the oil. These drops work great just before you go into bed. For anybody who has like sleepless nights, these can help massively. And I've got plenty of other products to actually test out from them. I've not tried this yet, but it's the deep freeze balm. I've also got the soft gel capsules. And the reason I chose these is because I've got a sweet tooth. And sometimes you can go through the gummies a little bit too fast. And guys, if you want to go and take a look yourself, make sure you use code triple B40 at checkout to save 40%. The link is in the description below.